All right. Welcome back to Tell Me Why. We are going to be finishing up Chapter 2 today. I have my emotional support coffee. Um... Yes, it's five o'clock in the evening and I'm drinking coffee. Um, cause I mean, after last chapter, there was so much, or last uh, stream, there was so much that happened. We were cleaning out the house and then the mad hunter showed up in a memory and it was very scary. Um, and then we went and confronted Eddie about an argument that he and the twins' mom that had the day that she died. The day that she died? I can't remember. And we broke into the police archives to find out answers for ourselves. Got caught, but it ended up going fine. So now we're at the store to talk to Tessa. So let's continue on. Okay, good. We can see this again. Where is everybody? Tessa's gotta be around somewhere. I think I'm hearing something. Well, at least we know the entire world didn't vanish. Given who is here, we can't count out the rapture quite yet. Oh, do we not? Oh, it's my... I need to take a breather. I'm gonna do a bit of shopping. You look for Tessa, okay? Honest. It's Tyler time. I like that we get to switch between the two. I stopped to take a leak just as I was finishing up. I see a big old boat was staring me down. So what do I do? I grab my odd six from the trunk and set my sights. And you shot it? Yes, sir. Wait, you said... Hey, guys. I hope I'm not interrupting. No, no not at all. Oh, hey. Tyler from the boat, right? Oh, huh. this guy. We keep bumping into each other, don't we? What were you guys talking about? I don't think you'd be interested. Kind of sounds like Clancy Brown. Uh, more commonly known as Mr. Krabs. But I know him from playing Detroit Become Human. He's oh man, I haven't had this cereal in forever. Some lieutenant frick. All I know is lieutenant because the Connor the android slaps him and says lieutenant. That's all I remember. I can't remember his name. I'm so frustrated. Okay, let's go find Tessa. Come in. Ah, it's Tom. It's not helpful. What up? What do you mean? We've got enough signatures. It should have at least been enough to stall construction while we figure out our next move. Well, why don't we schedule a meeting with the Alaska Wildlife Foundation? Try to get their support. Look, Harold, I have to go. We can pick this up at the meeting. Oh, okay. I should be on my way over soon. Top, where's your wife? Hello, Tyler. Uh, can I help you? Can I? Give me the circle. Excuse, excuse me, Allison. Hey, I hope this isn't a bad time, but is Tessa around today? She had to step out for a family matter. This family wouldn't be matter. something I could help with, would it? Yeah, maybe, actually. Uh, we were over at the police station and we took a look at Marianne's case file. <clears throat> okay. Why did Tessa come to the police station that See night? See what he thinks. She was it. looking for you two. To make sure you were okay. When she heard what happened, she was a mess. How exactly did she hear about it so fast? Can't remember who called, but you know how it is. No news travels faster than a secret. Everyone knew five minutes after Brown was on his way out. Ooh. Should we call her out to her husband? Yes. We're going to see if he knows anything Tessa about Tessa reported Marianne to social services. Did you know? Vaguely. But I didn't get involved. I didn't think I really had anything to add. 
You never thought to mention it? Well, no. I'm not sure how a thing like that would have come up. And I didn't want to rub salt in any wounds. Huh. How about when we were in the store yesterday asking about it point blank? That was between you and Tessa. I try to stay out of other people's affairs. Okay, bye, Tom. Okay. Thank you. Look, I'm sorry if you felt... ...resistance from people around here. To put it mildly. <laughs> Allison, you know this better than anybody. But your mother's death left a scar on this community. Now, I won't claim we went through anything close to what you did, but it was a cruel reminder of the limits of trust. Well, if we want to get past the limits of trust, we all need to face what happened, which means being completely honest about it. Yeah. We all want to find peace, kids. It's just harder for some people to talk about the past. Now, you let me know if you have any other questions, okay? What's up, Hi. Michael? Yes? You said I should remind you not to be late for your meeting, so don't be late. Uh, <laughs> yep, yep, I'll be on my way in a minute. Uh, so, kids, was there uh, anything else you two wanted to talk to me about? Did you ever hear any rumors about our mother? Like, who her father might have been? Mm, I'm not exactly a rumor monger. Father's fine. Your mother was close to a few men, but whether they were your father, I couldn't say. Who are they? Give us names. But look, I... Oh, gosh. Uh, I'm sorry. I really have to go. Uh, uh, to Michael, uh, could you finish up the storage room and then just uh, close up? Yeah, hey, sure thing, boss man. See you later. I think so, sus, Tom. I smell a conspiracy. You two want to help a brother out? Spend the afternoon here working for free? Yeah. Why not? <laughs> I came here to talk to Tessa, and she's not here. Uh, she she's at the cemetery, uh, visiting her parents. Oh. Yeah, let's... Hey, tell you what. Why don't you guys help me close the store, and then we can drive over together. I've been meaning to pay my uncle a visit. Can we just wait for her to come back here? I... I'm not really excited about going there. Allison, we don't have to visit her grave. I'm gonna start working in the storage room. <laughs> Tyler, join me when you're done. Sure thing. Just, just give me a back sec. Back away. All right. Let's talk. Where'd that question about our father come from? I'm just curious. I, I have just been thinking about who he might be. And if he knows anything <laughs> that could help us figure this shit out. <laughs> Your Why? father's the man. He wasn't hunter. a part of our lives. Besides, Marianne be, always said we never had a up. father. Well, her name might have been Mary, but I don't think she was a likely candidate for Immaculate Conception. Ha, <laughs> Bible jokes. Uh, hey. So, you look less than thrilled with the plan. Yeah, like I said, I am not stoked to be going to the cemetery. I know, but I'll be there too. And Michael. I'm not sure I want to drag him into this. Hey, he offered. He wants to be there for you. <laughs> for me, huh? Well, we need to get the store closed, so go give him a hand. Okay. Bye, Allison. Storage room? Store Frick, what did I get stuck on? The rug? One day, Trout King, you will be mine. Alright, what's up? What's up, Michael? Alright, I already counted there, but I just need you to double check a few things. It's okay. not complicated. I've got this in the back. Oh yeah? Because you're just that good, huh? I'm clowning. I don't even know where to begin. Yeah, I will. What do I do? Yeah, yeah. Here, let's start with an easy one. All right. Go to the back of the room and uh, tell me how many cans of Moto Bene brand tomato sauce we Bo have bene. left. Aye, aye. Aye, This is the back. That's bleach. 
snack time. Just kidding. Don't drink bleach. Molto bene. I wonder what's in that box. What's in the box? I don't need any of this. Okay. Just... Hold on. Let me count this. Oh, shoot. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. No, 14! Uh, I'm seeing 16 cans of tomato sauce. Ah, I scrolled too far! You sure you only counted the tomato cans? Ah, shit. I got cocky. It's actually 14. Look, I'll let that one slide just because it's you. Let's say you do on the next oh, one. Oh, no! I need you to count the bottles of bleach for me. On it. I on scrolled it. too far. It was 14. <laughs> bleach. There's, that's six. Six? All right. Not bad, Tyler. It, Not bad. Careful. They might give me your job. Oh, you can have it. Uh, what's next? Come here and help me with this. Okay. You're doing math? I'm not good at math. Hey, you remember the ad for this? What was their slogan again? Huh. Something poetic about time travel and life being weird, I think. Life is strange. That's 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 a reference to Life is Strange, don't know the other game. Because the the main character you went to a photography or she went to an art school for photography and the, the like the blue butterfly was like the symbol of, of her game and the events. So that's really funny. That's yeah. Look at me knowing things crazy. What's up? I need your opinion on this masterpiece. <laughs> Is that supposed to be me? Yeah, come on. Look at the hair. Nailed it, right? It's beautiful. I love it. 10 Honestly, out of 10. It's beautiful. Hey, don't make fun of me. I'm not. Oh, maybe a little bit, but <laughs> I like it. For real. Well, it helps to have a good model. So, this is what you're up to while I was out there doing your work? Flirting? What can I say? Flirting? I'm a multitasker. Hey, multitasker? I think you made a mistake here. Total amount should be 36. Oh, how dare you, sir? What? Ooh, <laughs> I just don't want you to math. get in trouble. The highest yeah, form you're of right. flirtation. You know, I'm off my game today. I ship it, though. All right. Anything else you want well, to do? I don't check? know anything about Yep. One last thing, sexuality. and then we should be free from this but purgatory. Hit me. Can you count how many plushies we have in that box over there? Okay. Okay. Plushies. All right, let's find a box of plushies. Are they all Trout Kings? Can I have one? Examine. Is that the box of plushies? I wonder what's in that box. Grab the box then! I wonder what's in that box. I wonder what's in your book. Uh, no, that's not it. Mm, it'll probably be an open box, right? Okay, let's see here. Boxo plushies. Box of sausage. Uh, no, that's not what Michael wanted. No. Do, do, do. <gasps> Yay, a figurine. Is that Mangy Muskrat? Yeah. It's perfect. It's me, guys. Let's take it. Is that... Yeah, it's the university internet connection, so I'm just gonna pause for a sec. Okay, it says it's good, so we're gonna continue. I need to be better about making sure the... Is that a is picture of a priest with little hearts? Yeah, that's the hot priest who hosts Bible study with Tessa. And for the record, that was Allison's doing. She had a crush on him for ages, but he is very, very hot. Shit, yeah. I remember him from when we were kids. Concerned. That's Father Batista. Yeah, he's got that silver fox thing going on now, see? Yeah, yep, I see it. I don't want to talk about that anymore. Oh, here we go. Wait, okay, before that, I want to see if there's anything else I can look at. Oh, I drank this at a party once. It did not end well. Oh, any good stories? I mean, probably. 
but nothing I remember really makes sense, so. I'm just gonna do a quick scan, see if there's anything else we can look at. You know, when you think about it, glass is really just tortured sand. Huh. Have you been sniffing this bright paint, Tyler? <laughs> tortured sand. That's the name of my next band, guys. Can I look at these posters? Juno Coalition for Equality Potluck. That was, oh, like many months ago. Can I sit? I'm not gonna sit. I'm on the job, I'm on the clock. Okay. So. What? <laughs> one, two, three, four. Sorry, let's start. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine? Nine is none of those, so I'm gonna go with the highest one. Uh, you've got about 11 left in that box. Did I get it wrong? Michael? Fear. Ouch, what the oh. fuck? Hey, sorry. It was just too tempting. Oh, oh, this means war. <laughs> Lesson number one in the ancient art this of inventory. Never let your guard down. This reminds me you of have that my no job. We used to throw cardboard at each other. First one with three confirmed hits wins. Cool. Oh. Oh. Phew. <laughs> gotcha. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Phew. Damn, overshot it. Ah. Oh, come on. Is that all you got, Ronan? Just you wait. I've got a strategy. Oh, yeah? Go? We'll see. Where'd you go, coward? Pop your head up. Pew! Boom! Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot! One more hit and you're out. Oh. Prepare to feel my wrath. <laughs> God, you're corny. Oh, this is so flirtatious. So, is this a typical work day for you? Nah, I usually don't have such good looking company back here. Ah! Oh, so I'm good looking company, huh? Yeah, well, don't let it get to your head. I'm still destroying you. You don't have any hits on me, bro. Where'd he go? Oh, cobarde! Ah! Let's go. Ah! Is that all you got? Wait, did you change cover? I didn't see. Phew. Boom. Boom. Just a little man. Oh. oh. <laughs> man, you're good. <laughs> I told you not to doubt the golden arm. <laughs> well, I'll never make that mistake again. This is very... Okay. I, I need to finish this inventory thing real quick. Your sister's probably done already. Here, let's hit the bitch's grotto. Sorry, hey, what? Fancy name for the couch where Allison and I sit during breaks. Ah, all right, cool. Let me see what you've done with the place. <laughs> oh, hey, see that container? Pizza time. That's oh, you. is this time? Huh? It's the trout I caught yesterday at the buzzard hole. Grilled it up with my world-renowned marinade. They're so domestic That's already. That's actually super thoughtful. Thank you. You sound surprised. No, sorry. I'm just not used to people randomly doing nice things for me. Oh, we'll have to fix that. I can't, I can't take it. Okay, I would've closed it if I didn't know I could take it. <laughs> Can we sit by Michael? Can we, we can't sit by Michael. Okay, y'all, this, we have to make this ship happen. As long as Tyler is cool with it, because we don't want to force we don't want to force anything. But like, Michael be flirting hardcore. Kent, Kent, hello. Thank you. <laughs> How hard is it to sit? Look, homies. Is this Chief Brown? Yeah. Are oh. you guys related or? Nah, but same clan. So what's your take on him? He's a pretty alright guy. 
all things considered? All things all considered? considered? Like, with him being a cop and all, I mean, it, it's good to see someone from the clan getting shit done. And he really cares about the community. We need someone like him on top. Mm-hmm. And I'm done. So, you think Tom's got the chops to be the mayor of Delos Crossing? Uh, I don't know. The guy's sweet and not entirely incompetent, <laughs> but it doesn't really matter. Vote for him to vote for Tessa. She'd be the one running the show. Oh. So I take it you're not Tessa's biggest fan? Yeah, you know, every time I put up flyers for queer events, she accidentally covers them. That's not No cool. way. Have you ever confronted her about it? Nah. I just keep my head down and count the days until Juno. Man, that has to be rough. It is. But out here, just surviving is a form of protest. What do you think about Tom's policy ideas? He's got a few surprisingly bold stances. Yeah, like his gun regulations. I gotta admit, I'm pretty impressed he's pushing for that out here. Exactly, but I'm not totally sure how I feel about that, though, to be honest. Really? Really. Historically speaking, the government taking weapons away from my people has not gone well for us. Oh, yeah. Accurate, yeah. I never thought about it that way. Interesting, interesting. It's interesting to hear the... Native American, or Native Alaskan side of Okay, stream says it's good. So is he a cool boss? Uh, cool? I'm pretty sure that's not a word anyone has ever used to describe Milk Toast Tom. Milk Toast! But he's all right. I mean, not the worst boss I've ever had. All right. All right. All right. I gotta tell you, it's so weird to finally meet the other Ronan. You mean the OG Ronan? I was born first, you know. <laughs> Is that so? The Allison said she was. Well, our mother never actually told us, but it was me. So, why is it so weird to meet me? Because I just heard Allison tell your story so many times. She told me everything about you. The fireweed, your transition. I hope that's okay, by the way. Yeah, it's fine. She asked me first. <laughs> yeah figures. That lady is thorough and she loves you like crazy. I know. So yeah, uh, you were probably the first person to know about it other than Allison. I'm glad he trusted me. And it's great to finally get to know you in the flesh. You're pretty all right. (laughs) But you're not too bad yourself. I hope nothing bad happens to to Michael. Especially around guys I'm trying to impress. So I wasn't blowing smoke when I said you should move to Juno with us. I know. I... I've got a community there. It could be yours too. Hmm. Fitting in. There's a concept. Y- you have no idea how life-saving a chosen family can be. It pulled me out of the dark more times than I can count. I hear you. Hey, can I ask you a question? Of course. Shoot. Why do you care so much if I move to Juno? <laughs> Look, like I said, I I want to get to know you. Because I'm just that fascinating, huh? <laughs> Honestly, yeah. I think you might be one of a kind, Tyler Ronan. Oh, we can decide. I think... We're gonna go for it. Well, golly gee, Michael. I think you're swell too. You're the uh, cat's pajamas. My heart. <laughs> Shut up. I've got way better compliments than that. Aww. But I can't open with my best, right? It's cool. So, I'll get more of those if I get to know you better? For sure. If that's something you'd be interested in. <laughs> I might be. Yeah. Oh, that's a. Aww. <clears throat> oh. Oh. Hey. I've been standing at that counter for an hour waiting for you two dum-dums to come back. It's not been an hour. Are you guys ready to go? Chill mm-hmm. out, man. I think we've done about as much damage as we can back it's, here. It's, yeah. it's cool that oh, not only go. are they... Exploring, like, LGBT and transgender ideas and, like, culture, but also implementing that with Native Alaskan. And I think it's really cool to see that. Um, 
because not only with the lack of Native Alaskan representation, but queer Here Native Alaskans just like. Thanks for letting me hit your ride over. No problem. You sure we can't drive you back? Nah, you're like stretching my legs. It isn't far. And anyway, can't put the wind in a bottle. <laughs> All right. Tessa should be at her parents' grave, not far from the entrance. Look for a big crooked tree. You can't miss it. I'm gonna go check in with my uncle. Good luck. For real. Ooh, that was a nice focus change. You look pretty spooked. I've never been a big fan of cemeteries, especially after, you know. I promise after this, we can chill at the house, cool? The pearl of a runlet that never ceases. With a hollow, boiling voice it speaks, and has spoken since hills were turfless peaks. I wonder what that's from. Should I know what that's from? Because I don't. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Footprint in the snow time. Oh, look at that, lovely. Okay, big old crooked tree. I'm gonna walk down this way. Hey, graves are back that way. I don't wanna go that way. So, Fine. did you ever come back? Shh, keep it down. Better? Much. Why do people always feel like they have to whisper in cemeteries? I don't know. Probably just a mirror neuron thing. A what? Monkey see, monkey do. Yeah. Uh, anyway, have you been back here at all since the funeral? No. I've never had a reason to. Thankfully. Can I look at the other graves? Let me do all the extra content except for the main content. Can you feel? Sorry, I keep singing Another Frozen. Come here all the time. It was so weird. Mom, why do we always come here? Does it bother you? No, it's just weird because we don't know any of these people. I, I mean, except Eddie's mom. It never hurts to say hello. Because they're very lonely. That's right, sweetie. And sometimes, even if you can't see them, they stay with you. In here. Always here. Mom? <laughs> Always. He loved us. A lot. But sometimes it was like loving us hurt her. Do you think she was just really scared of losing us? Maybe. Yeah. It's very... It, I don't know. I mean, most parents are scared of losing their kids. With the visiting... Graves, making sure people are not alone. All right, what's happening here? Forty-day parties observed forty days after passing to pay respects to the departed. So believe this is a more recent tradition. Family members are organized to share a meal, a fire dish, food is burned to nourish and comfort spirit of the departed. One year or more from the passing, a I, sorry, I can't pronounce that potlatch is held to first mourn and celebrate the life. Departed is hosted by the clan of the deceased. This is to honor the departed clan member through a traditional ceremony, show appreciation, and pay debts to the opposite mo moiety who supported the clan during the time of the war. Due to the national outlawing of native religions and way of life, much of our knowledge of the old ways of Tinket spiritual practice has been lost. Below are two everlasting examples of the love and reverence we continue to show our departed in the tradition of our ancestors. Wait. Are native religions and ways of life actually outlawed? Like, currently? If so, that's 
the worst thing ever. I'm disrespectful. Um, let's see. Mourning those who have journeyed to the other side. As love transcends all boundaries, the passing of a clan member is an event felt for the community. The people come together to mourn a loved one and lift their opposite clan member spirits. When an eagle is being mourned, the ravens shower love and strength upon mourning eagle clans. Likewise, when a raven is being mourned, the eagles are there for their ravens. After the service, it is customary for members in, of the opposite Moyuri to comfort the grieving family by bringing out their clan own regalia, regalia to symbolically catch tears before they hit the ground and comfort grieving clan members with support. That's really nice. And it's awful that colonizers and leaders chose to outlaw that kind of thing. We get in political. So what is it? Well, here's the crooked tree, but no Tessa. Let's check around for her parents' grave. That tree has scoliosis. Just to make sure this is the right spot. You think it's possible Michael remembered it wrong? Well, I've done inventory with him before, so yes. Find the grave test parents. Okay. That's what I thought. Not this one. Oh, I can read it. Taylor Phillips. Robin. Not this one. Look, Becker. there's Michael. There's Michael. Oh, I want to look at all the... Enterprise promulgated a set of rules that came out of the Later revoked. Okay. It was revoked, but the damage is done, basically. That's super... That super sucks. De Leon. That's the one. <sighs> Don't tell me we missed her. <gasps> Hello, Mr. Trash Eagle. birds! Kids. It's time. Sorry, but in my hometown, bald eagles, they hang around the cannery and eat all the trash from the cannery, so they're trash birds. And I, I, that's why I find it so funny that our country's like national bird wait we have a memory where i'm guessing where allison is that's probably the smart thing oh. you really have to go eddie you can hold my hand if you want i can walk fine on my own it'll be quick okay then we'll get something to eat the funeral. I barely remember it. That's probably for the best. I don't think either of us are exactly eager to relive what went on behind that gate. So... I know I said we didn't have to visit her grave. But it feels like the right thing to do. Yeah, exactly. I'm gonna read the other one, so... Don't mind me, just dilly-dallying in a second. Gotta pay our respects. You know, like their mom did. Adriel Yassi. That's a very interesting name. I wonder how they can see the names to put. Maybe based off of the people who worked on the game. I know Spider Man did that. They, in the homeless shelter, they had employees or volunteers of the month, and they were pictures of all the people who worked on the game. Hazel Salazar! That is such a sick name! Bro. And I got the snake on there, like freaking Salazar and Slytherin. Lost oh. in the chaos of history. What's that mean? Not sure, but Michael should know. To honor those no longer with us, the Clinkett Preservation Committee and the community of Delos dedicate this monument as an everlasting connection between past, present, and future generations. May the memory of our dearly departed never be lost in the chaos of history. May this be a resting place for our loved ones who have journeyed to the other shore. May our eternal love soothe the wounds of days past towards a brighter horizon. It's very optimistic. It's very nice. Do not step on graves. Okay. I didn't like uncle died. Last year. It was really hard on him. He's still feeling it. Long time no see. Do you want some company? Come on over. 
Make yourselves comfortable. So, how are you, um, holding up? Is this a bad time? With you? Never. Don't mind me. I'm not really here. Hey, I get to see your ugly mug almost every day. You're old news, lady. <laughs> you wound me. Deeply. <laughs> so, can I help you guys out somehow? Hey, can I ask you something about this place? Yeah, shoot. Oh, uh, what's up with the Clinkett Memorial? What's the story behind the Clinkett Memorial? May the memory of our dearly departed never be lost in the chaos of history. That was Uncle William. <laughs> oh, that was your uncle? Lost in the chaos of history? Well, let's say you wanted room for a school or a road and didn't give a shit about ethics. Easy, you just dug up our ancestors. That shit happened a lot. God, assholes. Yeah, and I mean, it still happens, but not as much. We have the elders to thank for that. I'll stop bugging you now. Well, I'm here. I think I'm getting the picture. <laughs> Not yet you aren't. As grumpy as he was, they didn't make him any sweeter than him. He's the kind of guy who accepted you for where you were at, even when he didn't approve. Not many of those out there. You and your uncle were really close, huh? Definitely. I could push his buttons without even trying. My family's old school clinket. Spent more time with my uncle than my dad. He was the first person to test out all my new recipes. Oh, that's sweet. That's sweet. Even before Allison. Yes, I should thank Uncle William for saving me from a muffin top. If you need a new taste tester, sign me up. As if you had a choice. I plan to hit you both up for feedback my whole way through school. I'm in. Ooh. As long as there's nothing as adventurous as that clinket style salmon with pepper and saffron. Pff, no, I'm promising that. Fortune favors the bold, goes double for food. Peace out. Talk to you later. You bet. All right. All right. Let's go find our mother. Well, let's go visit his house. So, space. how are you, um, holding up? <sighs> Everything's such a mess. I thought we'd almost be done packing by now. I'm so ready to put this place behind us. At least Mr. Hollywood Handsome over there is good company. Funny how you never mentioned what your brother looked like before he got into town. Oh, I just thought I'd surprise you. I can still hear you. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, you do realize I can hear you, right? Cover your ears, the grown-ups are talking. Okay, where is... Open the gate. Okay, anyway, girl. I know you're in it right now, but try not to let it get to you. Juna's gonna seem real boring after all this, huh? God, boring sounds so good right now. I'm just gonna Binging move on. terrible shows while my amazing roommate cooks something delicious. Heaven. Delicious food for tax returns? You got yourself a deal, mister. <laughs> Imagine knowing how to do taxes, that's crazy. Do you remember where she is? No. For what it's worth, I remember staring at the water during the funeral. <sighs> oh. Allison, please. I'm, I'm not going. Allison, come back. You said yeet. <sighs> we did not want to go. Yeah. Oh, whoa. Uh -oh. And he hoped that this would be easier than last time. Totally gone. At least this time, no one's sending me away. I'm holding you to that. Afterwards. You and I had a moment over there by the towing. Where do you think I'm right? going, Allison? I wonder if we could see that. Doesn't hurt to check. Give me the vibes. Heck yeah. I won't let them take you away. I'm gonna tell them the truth. 
You swore, Allison. I'm gonna be okay. Please, don't worry about me. I know I'm supposed to get over this brown thing, but... I really wish you'd been able to come visit that much. Yeah, me too, but... It's not fair. I'll be okay. You have to take care of yourself now. See? It's possible. But I don't think so. Well, I know so. Thinking about it, come. Ooh, connection issues. Yay.